Hello friends, welcome once again to my presentation on research and statistics. Today we are going to be looking at the simple random sampling, which is an example of the probability sampling approach in our population survey. Of, of course, I've explained in my previous video that the probability sampling is actually done in such a way that the sample is selected from the population randomly. And this actually gives equal chance to every item, unit, element, or individual in our population survey. Now, it is also important to know that the simple random sampling is most suitable when we are dealing with a homogeneous population. Now, a homogeneous population is a population that has most future, if not all, the characteristics are all common, maybe to the units or to the individual in that population. Now, take for instance, we are to conduct a survey that involves checking the attitude of the young Hausa female or married core members in Kano State to social media. Now, may I looking at that description, you have a lot of things that are common even to our target population. Number one, they are houses. Number two, they are, they are young. They are all married. They are female. And even their height may be about the same. So we refer to such population as a homogeneous population. Now, what are the steps for conducting simple random sampling? The first thing to do, say for instance, our target population is 1,000, 1,000 individuals. Now, the first thing to do is to make a list. It means we are going to write the name or the identity of every member of that population. The second thing to do is to assign sequential number. It simply means you are going to number them 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, until you get to 1,000. One number three is to choose sample size. Sample size, take for instance, your, your, your sample will just be 200 of that 1,000 you are going to work with. But mind you, in statistics, there is a formula for calculating sample size. Now, but take for instance, we are just to choose 200 as our sample size. Now, number three things to do is to use random number generator. Probably the first, maybe by the time you divide the 1,000 by 200, you are going to have five. Now, maybe the first five, you number them, you pick, you pick, you pick, until you pick your 200 sample. Isn't that simple? Yes. That is simple random sampling. In my next video, I'm going to explain other types of probability sampling. I'll see you again. My name is Felix Aydelo Thank you for listening.